especially to you, Miss. Good day also to you too. I am Teacher Ethan Luciano and I'm your lecturer today. In this learning platform, we are going to talk all about historical antecedents in which social considerations change the course of science and technology. But before knowing everything about this topic, I want you to follow the five word that stands for focus, interested, gain, sure can, and think. It will help you. Again, our topic for today is all about historical antecedents in which social consideration changed the course of science and technology. Have you ever imagined how science changed societies? Okay, because of science, we have very, very useful tools that we use today, and that is technology. Well, natural world is the human's home. Science aims to people to understand better about natural world and how natural world works for us. And because of science observations and experimentations, they discovered natural processes like weather, technologies, matters in everything that science tells us. Okay, now I'm going to discuss the difference between science and technology. As you can see in the picture that I've showed, it tells about science, the apparatuses, elements, matters, experimentations, and etc. Science is about the knowledge or the study of the natural world based on facts learned through experiments and observation. So science seeking facts to prove, that's why they conducted experiments and observation. As you can see also in the picture that I've showed, it tells about technologies. It shows the gadgets that works to people. Technology is the result of science experimentations that makes the life of people easier. Next is to understand how science is used in technology. Science is the pursuit of knowledge about the natural world through systematic observation and experimentation. Through science, we develop technologies. Technology is an application of scientifically gained knowledge for practical purpose. Scientists use technology in all their experiments. Science has a big impact and contributions in technology because the materials that are used in technology is experimented by science. Okay, let's move to the rule of science and technology. These are the rule of science and technology for people. One of the rule of science and technology is to change the way people live, connect, communicate, and transact with profound effects on economic development. The second one is the key drivers to development. Why? Because technological and scientific revolution underpin in economic advances improvement in health systems, education, and infrastructure. The third one is the technological revolution of the 21st century are emerging from entirely new sectors based on microprocessors, telecommunications, biotechnology, and nanotechnology. Time to time, um, the technological revolution of 21st century is become visible from these sectors. The fourth rule is to have the power to better live of poor people in developing countries. Science and technology helps us to have an improvement to ourselves and make things possible. The last rule of science and technology is differentiators between countries that are able to tackle poverty effectively by growing and developing their economies and those that are not. Science and technology doesn't only effects on poverty, but in all status of life of people in society. Okay, let's move to the connection of science and technology in society. But first, let us define society. The sum total of interaction as human, including the interactions that we engage in to figure things out and to make things. A group of individuals involved in persistent in social interactions. A large social group sharing the same geographical or social territory typically subject to the same political authority and dominant cultural expectation. You know what? Society becomes society if it is, has a school buildings, businesses, consists of many people, political authorities, cultures, and other aspects of 
society. What does science and technology and society mean? Science and technologies or science, technology, and society studies or STS is a study of how society politics and culture affect scientific research and technological innovation and how this in turn affects society, politics, and culture. We all know that we are surrounded by technologies that made by science, so it might has an effect on the development of societies. Science and technology studies. STS makes the assumption of technology are essentially intertwined in that they are each profoundly social and profoundly political. STS was a result of a sociological turn in science studies or interpreting the theoretical framework of science studies. STS relatively recent discipline originating in the 60s and 70s following Kunz, the structure of scientific revolution in 1960. How science and technology affect society? Science influences through its knowledge and worldview. Scientific knowledge and procedure used by scientists influence the way many individuals in society think about themselves, other, and the environment. Science and technology had a major impact on society and their impact is growing. How science and technology affect society? Science influences through its knowledge and worldview. Scientific knowledge and the procedure used by the scientists influence the way many individuals in society think about themselves, others, and the environment. Science and technology had a major impact on society and their impact is growing. Science is the root of everything we have now. But take note, society also influences science. Science has given a person chance to pursue societal concerns such as ethics. Ethics is a set of moral obligations that defines right and wrong. Here, individuals are obliged to identify what is the right and what is the wrong. The second one is aesthetic, a study of mind and emotion in relation to the sense of beauty. It means that what we saw, same as we think and interpretation of its beauty comes out. The third one is education. Science education gives students the knowledge and skills they need to succeed in school and beyond. Science taught us how things started and how we apply it and connect it in our aspect of life. The last and fourth one is justice. Science and justice share the common goal of seeking out facts, but their results often diverge. It means that facts of science is different from facts of justice. How science can have an effect on society. Scientific knowledge and the procedure used by scientists influence the individual the way they think. Most of people are following the belief of science. What they saw, they think more scientific explanation about it. Sometimes they're curious about the things or the materials used to create things. Second is the effect of science in society is neither beneficial nor detrimental. For instance, the technologies or machineries we use, we can take advantage of these things. But sometimes it will damage or harm the people. So this is the last part of my topic. It's all about relationship between science and society. The impact of science in the society is evident because it is actually happened. There are social influences on the direction and emphasis of scientific and technological development through pressure groups on specific issues and through generally accepted social views, values, and priorities. Society is a place where science makes things possible. Society also the place where science makes a procedure for the development. And science is also a place where Science educate people. Before I end this video, I want to share a petition made by Sir Winston Churchill. It tells that those who do not learn history are doomed to repeat it. It means that those people who doesn't learn history may experience difficulties to repeat it. So that is the end of my lesson. Hope you learned something from it from me. You're all dismissed.